Look at this, guys. There's always seagulls at the Kmarts. Get a job, ya bum! All right, guys, I am out in Cambridge, Ohio here. You've probably seen a couple other videos that I've been posting from this area, including the very first Kmart that was in this area and a couple of other label scars. And now I am over at the former Super Kmart over here in, uh, in Cambridge. At least that's what I understand that it used to be, and it does have the two entrances here, so... Uh, so I think it was a Super Kmart. In fact, I think it was also a big Kmart at one point, but I'm just not positive about that. If you know, feel free to tell me in the comments below, but let's check this place out. This building really isn't in too bad of shape. I mean, everything else in the parking lot is, but there's the first entrance there, and then there is the second entrance down on the other end here. We've still got the, the markers on the on the flag or not the flag poles the lamp poles here C and B and we got a clear down here I don't see well okay right there yeah that would have been the Kmart sign right there other than that I don't see any other Kmart signs but look how, like, all the lamp posts in here, they're all, like, bent over. I mean, just slightly bent. These over here aren't too bad. But this one here, somebody just completely wrecked into it. And it looks like it's just about to fall over. There's a tire over there, even. And then up here, I don't know what's up with these things, but somebody tried to bust them down or something. This reserved parking sign here bent over and then we got this one here that's been completely ripped down look at the lump in the concrete <laughs> that's kind of messed up let's go up here and uh, see if we can get any kind of a look inside the building I don't know if we can or not because they got the two sets of doors I see that the lights are on so let's See if we can see anything in here. Dang, I mean, we can see that the lights are on, but really that is, that's about it. Nothing but a reflection there. Now, I am curious about these carts over here. There's a hot and ready, if anybody's hungry. Yeah, these are Walmart carts with just with somebody's junk in them. Let's walk down here a minute. I wish we could see better inside there. Uh, let's check this one end right here a minute. Nah, you still really can't see anything except for the lights. If you were over here at night, you'd be able to see straight in there and see the whole sales floor. They have no paper on the windows, no blackouts, no nothing. And, uh, and the lights on inside. So yeah, if you were down here at night, you'd be able to just look straight in there and, and probably see the entire sales floor. It is so strange just to see this big empty parking lot here. I don't know that I ever shopped at this Kmart here. I really don't think I did. But the parking lot just God, it just looks crappy. I mean, it reminds me of uh, City View Center. All right, let's go check out these doors down here. Of course, at City View Center, the parking lot has dropped like three feet. But this is just, it reminds me of it. It's kind of crappy. Okay, so yeah, this looks like what would have been the Garden Center. We can see in there pretty good. Ooh, maybe if we go on the side over here, we'll be able to see through to the sales floor a little bit. You can see a little bit out inside there. Here's the prison yard. 
so it doesn't look like we're able to actually get up to those windows but let's walk around the side here for a minute look they have the um the driveway blocked off up here so you can't even pull in however down there you can <laughs> all right let's go over here a minute yeah you can see that the lights are on inside there I wish we were able to actually get inside here and walk right up to the window to look through. We'd be able to see the whole sales floor. We're just gonna go ahead and walk around the entire perimeter just for the heck of it. Here's a sign right up here. Old Kmart sign. Let's zoom in and see if we can see anything. Eh, I can't really tell. Looks like it's been painted over a couple of times. Let's see what's going on in the back here. Oh, surprise, surprise. Somebody dumping crap. Yeah, not a lot to see back here. It's all locked up tight. But, may as well walk around the whole thing. You never know when you're going to see some kind of a cool uh, Kmart remnant or collectible back here. Never know. Couple of skids here. Nope, everything's locked up tight. Coming over to the loading docks here. Yeah, they're all closed up. Nothing down here, except for just blowing trash. Probably just trash that people dumped off, you know, rather than anything that actually came from the Kmart itself. So. Man, I can smell that little Caesars over there. <laughs> There's the loading docks. Just a bunch of trash and crap back there. Well, that's it, guys. That's the whole perimeter of the, uh, the Kmart. Former Supercenter here in Cambridge, Ohio. And here you can see where it's all locked off to split the two parking lots. But if you wanted to, you can just pull right through there. So there it is, guys. The old Kmart Supercenter, Cambridge, Ohio. The building actually looks to be in pretty good condition, but the parking lot is just crap. So, all right, I'm out, peace.